Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Open XCOM Final Mod Pack. When we last left off, we have finished the terror mission over here somewhere in Africa, uh, fighting a mixed crew of uh, snake men, chrysalids, uh, mutons, floaters, reptoids, um, cyber discs, and also the new guys, the uh, the gazers. Yes, and let's have a look at the gazer. The single big eye is the most prominent anatomical feature of this alien. It has crustaceous, crustacean traits, but it is uh, much more evolved. The very thick armor is not simply worn. Cybernetic implants stem from it and connect to the organs of the creature. It is a shell for the creature. Yeah, so <laughs> we know now that they are almost immune to rail and gauss weapons, also to heavy explosive uh, packs actually. So we will need new weapons uh, to take them out and I will put uh, heavy plasma and heavy plasma clip into the queue. Maybe some more stuff, small launcher, uh, stun bomb, uh, mine probes, um, what else, flying suit, chrysalid corpse. That's about it, that's our priority for the next couple of episodes. First, let's finish the plasma cannon, we definitely need that. And let's continue. Large terror ship reptoid alien terror. Uh, are you scouts or are you actually going to do the terror mission? Because if you are going to do the terror mission, I'm just gonna ignore you. We have just returned from a terror mission I don't want to do anymore. Yeah, Wuhan. Well, people of Wuhan, I'm really sorry. We'll just uh, touch and go. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's these guys. Bye-bye. Civilians killed by aliens 8, but I think our score will not suffer that much. Uh, where is the graphs? Score is uh, excellent. Okay. Ethereal terror mission, so we'll have yet another terror mission with Ethereals. Fighter man in black, okay. These guys are going to Southeast Asia. I guess we'll send a couple of craft after them from here as well. Maybe one from Canada. Yeah. Okay. Redirect, new target, actually stay there, okay. Patrol, okay, and we'll send Raven 7 as well, and the rest too. I may not need all of them, but uh, you as well, but uh, better safe than sorry, I will try this with avalanche only at the beginning might work one hit second hit and it crash lands okay <laughs> so i didn't even need that many but uh, that's fine that's fine we'll let them rot because why not and uh, proxy grenades are finished, okay. I actually wanted to do uh, some armor, the synth suits. Let's do two, just to show them off. Okay, we have a replacement soldier for um, Dr. Zyman, which has, uh, wow, very bad stats. No bravery, no reactions, no time in its uh, bad accuracy, bad sonic strength. I will directly sack this guy. I think this is the first time I actually sacked anyone. But uh, Dr. Zyman deserves a better soldier. So let's uh, give him one. And we also need a new craft, the Thunderstorm. We wanted to do that for some time now. Okay, continue. Plasma cannon research is finished. The gravity beam directs a finely channeled imploding gravity field. Whatever. 
Doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, let's continue with heavy plasma. 100 scientists on that. And plasma clip. Okay, and let's allocate manufacture not here in uh, Brazil. Take all people out from this project and do a plasma beam. Takes 15 Illyrium, so let's do 10. That will eat half of our Illyrium here. That's fine. Uh, I think Plasma Beam actually during reloading will uh, eat Illyrium as well. I don't know how much, but uh, we'll try it out on one of the on one of the uh, craft. Large Scout research. Yeah, we don't care too much about them. I don't want to go on too many missions. We have um, most of the things we need. Currently, I would like to catch up um, with the research so that um, the gazers are not such a nuisance because you've seen what happened last time. They didn't want to die. I think I actually... Dr. Zyman was in here. Yes, he was. So let's uh, give the place to Grimwit. And in Brazil... It looks okay. Fine. So how many are manufactured? Six already. Uh, let's put one on Raven 5. Okay. And see how much Illyrium will that eat. Very large, very high lab ship full of floaters. Alien Research North Atlantic. So who wants to go on a mission? Let's wait for them to land somewhere. And depending on where they land, we'll decide who will go there. Okay, so these guys are finished. Let's uh, wait a little bit. They went there. It will be a sort of night mission, or is it just gonna turn day? It's... Uh, it's day here right now in November, so we might have problems there. I think it, it it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Let's uh, actually save as lab ship. And if it's night, then we'll abort. No, we didn't even have to save anything. Let's uh, equip the craft this one and we'll need more crew uh, one two three okay and uh, Ravski and Grimwit will be snipers that's fine and I think who has a big armor um, horse can Shiro and Santino okay so you guys will go uh, up Horst, Kanshiro, and Santino. Okay. Maybe... Maybe Horst and Graal should switch places. Nah, nah, that's fine. Okay. That's cool. Since we have more people, I need to do some inventory management. Oh, and I need to de-equip these things. Give me just a second, I'll be right back. And we're back. So let's go, right? Iron Fist after them. Yeah, it will be probably day. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's day. Okay, so cool. I think um, maybe you. Nook has 67 firing accuracy. That's actually quite nice. We can take care of this guy, perfect. And uh, let's uh, do some scouting with the doggies. Nobody there. Hmm. That is interesting. That is interesting. The problem is that this looks too good. Too good to be true. Uh, 
And it's again a very small map, actually. I think these lab ships always come with a small map or something. Hmm. There's another floor here. So unless the second doggy tells me otherwise, there's probably nobody here, nobody here. So I can take out the snipers. But um, maybe I should also scout somehow. And we need smoke. There's no cover over here whatsoever. We are in some sort of glacier terrain. So we'll need to make our own cover. Yeah. So Enrico. Prime grenade. Throw it there. Anywhere will do. Thank you very much. Then uh, hide over here. Okay, Santino. In the smoke. Face this way. Kanshiro in the smoke face this way okay then we'll need probably some smoke over here as well in the ship throw it right here and okay you can do something Horst probably go here face this way we'll need some smoke there as well so Graal doesn't have anything Devilkin has a smoke grenade, throw it to him and he will throw it to here, that's fine. Then a couple more people can just move back, hopefully you will not be in grave danger, actually, now when you think about it, there might be, there, there is usually a door here, well actually it's here, but uh, since I see a door there, it might be also over here. Maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to throw, throw, throw a, how do you call it, a smoke there as well, so put this into backpack, prime this, and you need uh, 14 to throw, really? So just uh, put it on the ground, Ravski. Step aside. You can pick it up, Grimwit. Come up here and throw it over there. That's cool. Go down. And even one step more. That's okay. Maybe I'm too cautious, but you can never be too cautious, especially on such open terrain. Graal, this is a smoke cover, so come here. Next, Thomas, you should probably hide. Quintus. Thomas, uh, hide even more maybe. Yeah, this is fine. Come here. Hmm, maybe not anymore, you know, like, <laughs> I don't want any blaster bombs. Why did I even go here to a big UFO? Is there anybody else with time units and smoke grenades? Nook, theoretically. And nobody else. This will have to do. So I think I forgot to smoke this. <laughs> so Nook, put this on the ground. Come here. Zavis, pick it up. Prime it. And you need 14 to throw it. Or is it? Is something there? I think there might be something there. Let's throw it right here, okay? 
and step aside if you can you can't face this way then you too Thomas Devilkin I don't want you guys to die so can you actually run like far this will do excellent and they shouldn't be able to see us from here so come there come there face this way and that's about it right right next turn now we have smoke we have also a floater visiting us I wonder why did nobody reaction fire um, okay how can we see him oh you can see him of course <laughs> oh good doggy good doggy you can see the two floaters through the smoke cover that's actually very very nice of you Okay, that one first, and this one second. Uh, there's somebody over here, we don't want to shoot through you, right? Then... Uh, who else has a good angle? If you step over here... Do you have a good angle? Yes, you do. Okay, these guys most certainly don't have enough time in it. Well, actually, you can go here. That's not bad at all. Um, Grand Serfibras, though. Yeah, that should do. Okay. We want to go a little bit... Uh, less clumped and doggy maybe 32 yeah open the door doggy you can see a guy right there uh, that's nothing don't you worry we have seen worse stay there and this doggy will continue scouting the door Hopefully he's far enough. Maybe one more step. We'll see. And you are somehow also not uh, in good position. Kenshiro, stay there. 40, 26. Yeah, one more step back. Okay. So they can indeed come from here, which is uh, not so cool. This time Grimwit will uh, prime the grenade, throw it right there, and Ravsky will throw it over here and go down. We'll go up uh, once we have some cover. These guys should be fine. Maybe they can even reaction fire. We should be seeing them coming out. The single doggy over here can do that. But this time they decided... <laughs> Hello. How are you? Okay, that guy didn't move. We do have a uh, jump armor, so we could potentially also um, fly over there. But um, that's a big if. What I want to do is to go and explore a little bit over here. So there might be a second entrance. But it seems like there is no second entrance there. 
Yeah, this is sealed off. This is sealed off. So only somehow through here maybe and somehow through down there. This is not good. Where is the big door? Hmm. Okay. So we'll uh, we'll come a bit uh, closer with everybody. Come here. I have no idea if they will be able to see us through this smoke or not. But um, we have to come closer somehow. Gavin over there. I really don't like maps which have no cover at all. Enrico. If you run. Yeah, that could do the trick. Okay. Turn around. And maybe some more guys. Thomas or Zavis. Let's take Thomas. Where, Thomas? Where? I don't know. Also, let's... Uh, Throw a couple of um, proxy grenades there. So prime that. Hopefully you have uh, caught it, yes. Come out and throw it over here. Excellent, Thomas. Come back. I think that's it. Next turn. Nothing. However, we'll do this one more time with Devilkin. I will throw it right there to Mike. And this time Mike will come out and throw it... Uh, this seems like a door, maybe right there. Or maybe, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, maybe over there. Yeah. So they should be dead if they decide to come out there. And uh, if I do one more here, well, I can't do one more there because <laughs> I wouldn't be able to come in anymore. This looks promising though. Uh, okay, this guy is right uh, at the elevator, so he will come out next turn. Stay there, Phoebus. Mike over here. Devilkin Zavis. You guys are starting to take um, suffocation damage, but uh, not too much. Thomas, just in case, prepare a grenade and uh, Zavis will go away because he doesn't want to get uh, blasted to pieces should you be killed. Okay, then Ravski. Can come over here and you can come over here. Perfect. I think we are fine. We just wait this guy out and uh, we'll be on our way. Yeah, that's how I see it. Next turn. Sorry, doggy. Okay. Zavis. Fire. Okay, well then uh, we have also Graal. That worked. And second doggy can give us some more information. 
Maybe I can teach doggies to use the uh, motion scanner. <laughs> that would be cool. Uh, that would be really cool, actually. I don't like this, you know. One single entry. There should be a door here. It gives uh, the aliens the opportunity to drop on us. It gives us opportunity to have one and more entrance. This is just uh, such a big uh, point of failure and uh, bottleneck that... Uh, I don't know. Not a good game design. Okay. Enrico, come here. We need more firepower. Graal cannot. Kenshiro, they didn't seem to be able to shoot at you, so a bit closer. Santino, you don't have any melee weapons actually. <laughs> um, we might want to try to... Maybe there is another opening somewhere, maybe here. Mm, I somehow don't think so. Let's try this a few more times. Okay, anyone there? No. Don't stay there, your comrade has died there. Uh, Enrico, yes, you have the motion scanner. So face this way. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, so many aliens. Uh, hmm. I don't know. This doesn't give us any options, basically. We just have to go there and storm the UFO for a single elevator. If I was the aliens, I would just put uh, 7 billion mines here and that would be GG. <laughs> okay, somebody's right in front of you, actually, right there as well. So if I open the door, would I be able to shoot it's like here here if i put you there zavis you can shoot right in there i think open the door nobody <laughs> uh, false alarm false alarm duck i don't know this is just stupid Santino, you need something else. Horst, take his grenade. We can't use the heavy plasma yet. Gavin. We basically need to get a couple of people here, but that's a grenade magnet par excellence. So... Yeah, I don't know. So tell me in the comments below what would you do in this situation. Because I feel stuck. Quintus, run over there. We'll have three people. Okay. Then, uh, Thomas, you have a primed... Grenade, come here. Um, Devilkin. There. Okay. And uh, Nook. Stay here. Anybody? There, no. Next turn. Yeah, this can take forever. <laughs> Nobody there. Okay. I think um, our... F Maybe I should have left the doggy there. Okay, doggy. You come here, and these three gentlemen will uh, 
take it uh, from the sides. Enrico, come uh, here. Turn around and you grant Sir Phoebus over there. Okay, and let's uh, hope they will see the doggy and kill him instead of us. You will be next. You will be next. We have five people. Even if a couple of them die, it will not be that bad. Graal, you're next. Mike is too valuable. You'll be over here, Mike. Horst, no weapon. But we need your armor. Just like we need armor of Kenshiro. That's fine. Thomas, maybe the first guy up can uh, hold a grenade <laughs> and uh, deal with them like that. Can anyone still move if I miss? Uh, probably not. No. So Thomas will uh, throw it to you later. Bill, you have a rifle without a shot. Come and help us. This is, uh, this is not <laughs> a nice situation. And the turn. Okay, nothing happened. Strangely enough. Um, throw it to them. Now the question is, where is it? Something there. Jeez, now I lost it. Did you catch it? Yes. Okay, Gavin. Um, I think you can um, take it. And you know what? Give it to Doggy. <laughs> Throw it to Doggy. Doggy will uh, pick it up and carry it in his mouth. And he sees a guy, goes up there, doesn't get shot, which is excellent. Where was he shot from, though? <laughs> What? You see a guy... Oh, one level up. And you can't go there. Well, that's a bummer. I'll open here. Nothing. Open here. Nothing. That's cool. You survived, doggy. Who can shoot? Enrico, come on, kill him. Maybe once more. You can do it better, Enrico. Don't tell me this was your best performance. Quintus, just a snapshot. Excellent, come back. Gavin, that was good uh, grenade. Uh, we might not want to go there <laughs> just yet. What is this, by the way? Is it some sort of barrier? I don't know. But uh, we are prepared and it doesn't look that bad. Stay here and stay here. Okay, next turn. They kill the doggy, but they will perish themselves. Ha ha ha, the revenge of the doggy. Yeah, I have to do this more. I have to do this more often. This was fun. Um, Enrico. Somebody right in front of you. Take him out. Thank you very much. Run over here and let somebody else have a look. Uh, I think Kenshiro with his big gun 
and good armor could have a look around doesn't see anything and uh, we'll stay here uh, so another suicide bomber will be Mr. Graal Otonami take this grenade prime it and uh, You'll run there soon enough, don't you worry. For now, just stay here. Um, may, that may be too close. <laughs> Come out. Come out. Okay, they really don't want to come out from here. There might not even be a, a door here. But it would make sense if it was at... Uh, no, this guy, this guy came from up here. There must be a door here. I'm confused. Next turn. How many turns do we have now? 11. Okay, so that's still doable. Um, Enrico. There is a lot of guys behind you, so Graal, this is primed, run over there, they will be here. We can't go there, there's a blockade. Okay. Come here. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. You can just barely throw this. And even though we will destroy the Illyrium, we will throw it all the way there. It shouldn't kill us, it should kill him. So bye bye 50 Illyrium. Was nice knowing you this guy. Can probably even shoot at us, which is really bad. Um, whoa, this guy can shoot at us as well, through here. So why can't I do such shots? Or maybe he missed as well, <laughs> maybe he missed as well. Yeah, the game was uh, generous to us. Okay, prepare an aimed shot. Wow, no, just a snap. Wow, that was cool. You wrecked it completely. Uh, Gavin, turn around, go up, snapshot. Come on, you have to do it now, people. Bill, you can do auto shot if necessary. Uh, that's a good question. Oh, even out a shot was not enough. That is sad. Anyone else? I don't know, you know, in power suit you are protected from fire. But I don't know if that protects you from, uh, from this as well. I mean, it might. You know what? I want to test it. I've, I've never, uh, never done that. Test flame thrower on ourselves. So, come over here, Phoebus. And can you shoot? Yes, you can. But if you could, make a few more steps, it would be even better. That's nice. So do you think it will uh, kill this guy? It actually goes f down the armor. It might kill him as well. No line of fire. Oh yeah, you need to duck, right? This is so stupid. 
Well, we want to try it. If, if it doesn't work as I think it works, uh, we'll reload because that's just a test, right? Okay, he's dead and we are not dead. Hmm, so it may indeed uh, completely protect us from uh, from fire damage from the flamethrower, which would be excellent because we can do this uh, and abuse it <laughs> if necessary. Um, yeah, that looks promising. Enrico, I think we need to open this door now. Or maybe Devilkin. Yeah, Devilkin, open that door and kill this guy, please. Duck. Come on, kill him. Oh, jeez. <laughs> no, Devilkin, 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 what did you do? Why didn't you kill him? Man, well, hope that he will panic, because otherwise you are dead, unless he can shoot through here. Enrico, you need 21. Come over here and save him. Oh, Enrico. Enrico. That was not what I expected. Thomas, <laughs> we might need reinforcements. Okay, and Santino as well. And Horst as well. Maybe I should have taken these guys as meat shields. Um, first thing, actually. How are you doing? You're doing quite well, I think. Can't be said about these guys. Look at them. They've seen better times. <laughs> They've seen better times. So it's been an honor, Devilkin. I think I won't be able to save you this time. Let's have a look. No, look at him. He survived. Good job, Devilkin. <laughs> I don't know how you managed to do that. But uh, you did. Illyrium is gone. We don't even care. There's probably more people over here, but not in the immediate vicinity. Where did that guy go? Or did he pass out? He might have passed out. He's not here. Enrico, 27, you might not have enough. Hmm. Where are they hiding, is the question. They are not hiding over here. Okay. They are not hiding over here either. Face this way. Can Shiro block this entrance? Bill here. Enrico there. Phoebus, you can see something. How did that guy got, get there? 23. Kill him. Oh, really? You even hurt yourself. Oh, yay, 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 you're on fire. <laughs> Phoebus. That's not how it's done. And we unfortunately went away with Kenshiro. So, who could possibly shoot? 
Gavin, I think you might be able to do so. Kill. Well, good luck with that. Who else? There is uh, Quintus over here. Can you see him? Yes, you can. Kill. Okay. You are as incompetent as the other guy was. I think you pay with your life for such mistakes. Unless Santino or Horst will be generous enough. 49 is good. And 46. Horst, can you... No, you can't. Hmm. I wanted to run all the way there. Maybe you can. Yes, you can. So, run over here, Santino. And save their lives. Save their sorry lives. Good. You need to face this way now. <laughs> if he decides to go that way, and you need to face that way. Uh, so many, so many bad decisions, so much bad aiming and so much bad gameplay <laughs> in a single episode. Yay. Okay, roll on the floor or something, Phoebus. Just put yourself out of fire. These guys don't have anything to do. You can fly. Yeah, we need fly... Oh, there is a door here, indeed. We need a guy in... Uh, more guys in flying suits. Okay, here we go. Something somewhere died. And it wasn't this guy. Do you have anything to... <laughs> hit him with, you know? Like fisticuffs or anything. <laughs> Look at him, he's burning. That's funny. 36 might be enough. 31 just enough. Yeah, good night. Good night. How are you doing, uh, Phoebus? Not well. Not well. Can't help you though. Somebody died there. That might have been the guy which we set on fire over here. Must have been, actually. Um, Bill? Can't see anyone there. We'll uh, use Kanshiro to block the door. Thank you. You turn this way. Phoebus! Just don't die, okay? Don't die on me now. Do we have a different weapon? Oh yeah, we have a... Look at that. We have a Toxi gun. That's what we shall use. Excellent. Uh, so now Santino has a gun as well. This is clear. Santino, you will go through there. And uh, Graal can't go anywhere. Okay. Um... In the corner, Gavin. Devilkin. Have a look. Nobody in front of you, really. So it might be safe. Oops, it's not safe. It's not safe. Uh, go away. Go away. Go away. You too. You free. <laughs> Just uh, somehow stay alive, people. Stay alive. Horst, you will go this way. Okay, next turn. 
No big deal. This might be the last one. Horst, I think if you see him, just fire a rocket. <laughs> Not at this distance, though. Um, oh, man. What did you just do, Horst? <laughs> uh, no, that's not enough. Oh, man. Okay. There doesn't seem to be anywhere, anyone here. Which is good. Now, this guy doesn't even seem like he has a weapon. He probably doesn't. So, step aside and let's use Quintus to shoot him. It's not the end of the mission, yet. Horst faced this way. You come here. You can duck. You can come here. You can come here. Hmm, Kenshiro, that's not a good position to be right now. Bill will back you up. And Graal will back both of you up, if he had enough energy, that is. Next turn. They must be panicking by now. I would be. Look at them. Two guys right there. Bill. That's, uh, that's a job for a grenade. Duck. Throw it right there. And Kanshiro, oh, fire launcher, that <laughs> would be nice as well. Throw it in the middle of the control room, run away, and that's GG. Yeah, nobody there anymore. Okay, GG aliens. <laughs> Very cool. Aliens killed 15, alien corpses recovered 16, uh, support units destroyed 2, power sources, navigation, food, entertainment, surgery, examination room, habitat, alloys and only 50 Illyrium. But uh, that was a nice, nice, nice mission, I have to say. We do not have enough uh, doggies. How many do we have? Well, doesn't matter. Let's take uh, like one, two, three, four more. Excellent. Return back home. And oh, it's been <laughs> a long episode again. Time flies when you enjoy yourself. Okay, we have tested the flamethrower. That was actually a good experience. Uh, anyway, part um, 87. It's the end of it. When we come back, we'll actually try to find out how many... Uh, okay, it's full. So one. Re so we will uh, not do it when we come back, we will do it right now. So 150 was uh, what remained after the production. And now after refill, we have... Um, 100? Wow! So each shot with the plasma beam costs one Illyrium. Now that is a lot. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a lot. So we might want to... <laughs> we might want to use them with uh, caution. In the vanilla it didn't cost anything. In final mod pack it maybe costs too much. <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. I mean, we have like, in Madagascar we have like 700 delirium, so why not? Uh, but uh, still, I mean, it's, it's, uh, it's a significant amount, let's say it like that. Okay, I will move the craft around uh, between the episodes and... Uh, and when we come back, uh, we'll see where I moved them. Let's save once more, I've been talking too much. And uh, I say bye-bye, till next time.